Good night, guys. We have a, an interesting call. We have a, it looks like one of those lithium batteries off of the 605 and Telegraph. We have Big Flipper and Dave. And we have uh, Castro with the Landau. Uh, I'm sure you can tell. There's big scrapes here. Looks like it uh, it buckled the trailer. Nothing there? Tires and everything is fine. Okay. What happened is, you'll be like, what the hell? Oh, uh, okay. See it right there? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, it buckled it. That never happened. And it's a brand new tra uh, trailer, 2022. I don't know what happened, but yeah, never happened before. It's heavy. These are those. Uh, is that a generator or one of those lithium batteries? Lithium batteries, I think. I'm not yeah. sure. Or a generator. I'm not. I'm not really sure. They, they didn't tell me what it is exactly. Yeah. But even even that, uh, it's, this is one of the five loads. My other four drivers, my friends, took the same. They're already on their way, not that happy with only this trailer. I don't know if the trailer is weak or I don't know what happened or if it only happened to me. The others just left. Yeah. Okay. Look at Dave. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you dropped your, oh. your toothpaste. Yeah, it buckled it, huh? Look up here, too. Well, the yeah, it buckled the whole thing. Oh yeah, I took it all out. Yeah, I broke the welds. Heavy, heavy sucker. Uh-huh. Obviously it has to be transferred with another like one of yours. Yeah. But the trailer, once the load is off, if it's up, I was gonna take the trailer, you know? It's possible, yeah. The one way we get it off, it might, yeah, because, it might be. Yeah, because once it's empty, that's not a big problem for me to go like. That's not a big problem for me to go like 60 miles. You know? Yeah, because all the way would be off of it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. But I'll just take the trailer, just drop it off, but the load, obviously, you know, have to. Okay. Yeah, we'll see. The one way we get it off. Okay. Uh, until now, do I take the chains out? All the chains off the load. You want me to do that for now? Might as well, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, just get a head start. Yeah, that's yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. I'll take all the chains off. Okay, sounds Thank good. You, no worries. Yeah, it's all yeah, I got messed up. You ever had this before? Or this is the worst? You ever had this before? No, we had stuff buckle before. The whole trailer? Yeah, the whole thing just buckle in the middle. It happens, yeah. Were they, were they following the coil? No, it just did various materials. Yeah. It just depends. Sometimes it's just uh, the trailer's weak and yeah, it, it cracks it. No, it's one of those lithium batteries. I was we lifting with Josh. Same exact one. Okay, I'll get the chains out for now. Okay, thank you, appreciate it. Eastern European. You can see right here, you can trade right here. You can tell, look at it, two axles? Yeah. Yeah, normally they bring those three axles. Yeah, but if it would have been a little further back, probably would have It would have been fine. Oh, <laughs> 75 five? 70, 70, That's gonna be a heavy. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. And uh hopefully they able to pull it forward, huh? Sure you will, but I'm saying like so we're gonna have we'll turn you around and Because if you're square with it, I think I'll be able to pick it off the corner. I'll be if, assuming it's 70, I'll be picking up 35 as long as you're square with it. So you want me to get square with it? Yeah, you get square with it. Okay. I mean, luckily, this uh, this driver was able to uh, take it off. I saw the skids right on the lane, <clears throat> luckily, he didn't get stuck on the freeway. And they were able to summon us directly as a private rather than to CHP. But, uh, 
I don't like to toot my own horn, but there's not many companies that can pick off 70,000 off the side. Like I was discussing with Dave, I'm gonna have Dave wear with the, with this lithium battery, which he'll be at his strongest. Being that it's a 20 foot container, I'm gonna have to be a little bit off of my corner, which is still uh, sufficient for Big Flipper to lift off 35. We're gonna wait for uh, THP to cross off that lane and, uh, and we'll go from there. Hey Dave, you have 12 ton blocks? You have 12 ton blocks? You wanna use my 15s? I have two extras. I guess. Yeah? I don't, I don't get any. Huh? I don't get any, so. <laughs> go right now. Yeah? Hola, mijo. How are you doing? How are you guys going to set up? We'll set up Dave Square and then I'll pick off the corner. Cause it's a 20 footer. We're gonna have to leave that lane, huh? Yeah. Hopefully by the time that we lift it, it creates some lift on this trailer. Yeah. And you can pull forward, just drive off. And then you just come around and back up. <laughs> you guys gonna load me over there or? Yeah. Or they are? Nah, we're most likely we're gonna do it. So next, I'm gonna put these uh, container links. They're ready for 32,000. This whole uh, container weighs about 70K. So it's a very, very heavy uh, lithium battery container. And these are apparently a very hot commodity. I've been seeing uh, a lot of these uh, haulers take these batteries, especially into the the more the more uh, remote the more remote areas. They take them out to Vegas. They take them out to various areas where they need a uh, auxiliary power. I don't know. They use these as backup. Uh, for some of the hotels as well, I've seen them get transported over there. The reason we know is because we uh, had a pretty big job in Wilmington where we loaded uh, a lot of these. Very heavy, extremely heavy. So we're just uh, rigging to expedite this. That way we're not blocking uh, lanes. 
Dave seems to be done already with his. Oh, CHP's there. Just that one lane? We're gonna need a lane and then uh, I'm gonna need a traffic brake so I can turn around my truck. <laughs> it's the, the problem is, is the container's 20 feet. So our boom lengths are too long so I need to go back to back to be able to pick it off safely because it weighs 70,000 pounds. Uh, we're already pretty much set up. Minimum an hour. An hour? Minimum. Minimum. It's it's pretty heavy. It's not it's not a light load. Seventy thousand. Seventy thousand. Yeah, it's right here. Look at it. you see that? Seventy seventy five uh, fifty. So my sergeant, so you're probably not gonna be able to hold those things for like an hour. You probably to the gate. It's too dangerous for everybody. Now you might have to figure out a way that you can come back at a later date. Like tomorrow or something when it's safer, when it's not light traffic, you guys can do it. Other than that, I'll give our sergeant is gonna let us close it for two hours or an hour. No. So you may have to make some phone calls because we're not gonna be able to shut down the traffic just for this situation. Wow. Because you're not blocking, does that make sense? Yeah. It's not an immediate hazard for you. Alright, we'll come back. We'll, like, we'll, just have to, we'll just have to hug that lane right there. Can you give us one? Oh, so we'll, we're gonna ask the sergeant. I think that's Teddy. He makes the calls, not us. Yeah, ask him if we can have it for one hour. And if he says no, then you guys have to figure it out. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Think that'd be worse to do in the daytime. Yeah. 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 You can't go talk to the sergeant. I mean, it's not my fault that trailer is a piece of shit. Exactly. Correct. Well, like, it's not muscle. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so he said just because of safety, because the DUI drivers are all right? It's not safe for any of us to be here at this time, loading those lanes. Does that make sense? What time uh, can we come? Yeah, commute hour, whatever time you guys want to come back, just not now. Okay. So whether that's 8 in the morning, 7 in the morning, it's better than now. Okay. Make sense? Ah, that's fine. I yeah, understand. That's, yeah. No worries. So okay. It's just for our safety and your guys. Of yeah, course. No worries. Okay. Yeah. I think that traffic is busier or upset me. They wanted to slow down. No, but it would be heavier. There would be more ball. That was very unfortunate. Uh, the sergeant didn't want to give us a lane. He said that uh, the DUI drivers might hit us. We have to come back at commuter hours. The bolts? I know, I saw a whole bunch of them. Oh, they're right there, look at it. They're not from this whose trailer, are they? Yeah. They are? Yeah, they're all over the place. <laughs> it lasted? Yeah. All the frame bolts, huh? Oh yeah, these are these are the ones that are at the bottom. They just shave them all off. Yeah. The socket? Palestine is free. Oh, free Palestine. Palestine free, you mean? Yeah. Who's dyslexic? So we came out for this call last night and uh, CHP didn't allow us to work. Now with some daylight, we can see all the, the frame bolts here. All scattered all from the, the guy dragging it. Yeah. Yeah. See all these little frame bolts here. 
scattered on the on the roadway. I'm sure some of them landed in. Uh, oh yeah, they're right there. You can see all those boats scattered around the the freeway. I'm sure someone got a couple pop tires. You see one over there on the number one lane. You see another one on the three lane. Hello on the three lane. Oh, yeah, they're all over the place. We're mostly here, but. Hey Dave, look, they're all over the freeway. Look. Right there. Over there in the on the HOV lane, number one lane. Another one right here on the third. That's from me, there's no way. Ooh, those bolts are scattered everywhere. So now we have our container links there attached on both ends of the of this lithium battery. Yeah, don't step there. <laughs> we'll keep right through. Yeah. Yeah, don't step there. Yeah. No. Do no not kicking it. No kicking it. <laughs> Oh yeah, don't jump on it. No tap dancing. <laughs> Alright, just to show you, uh, last night we noticed the same thing. We noticed that the that the trailer uh, all buckled, and here you can see the. You see how the weld just 
came apart here on the on the neck of the trailer. It clearly snapped it off. You can see right here we're also buckled up here on top. Uh, a lot of bolts I got scrapped on the on the side of the freeway when it uh when it was dragging. Yeah, I clearly took them off from the bottom, dude. What? I say I clearly snapped off all those bolts on the bottom. I had to have them. Yeah. Do you think I'll be able to drive the trailer to the yard by any chance, or? Hopefully, the moment we get some weight off of it, yeah, we'll see if it comes up a couple of inches, you know? Yeah, I'll chain it to the bottom deck and upper deck, chain it together just in case, yeah? Yeah, just in case, we'll see. Hey, brother, I don't think this is out. There's like more than 20 on You gotta see how it is on the bottom. Yeah. If it's under, I'll be like shocked because it's... I know. Because they look like they're shaved off, you know? Yeah, they be out. The whole... Yeah, the whole neck. Like when, when I turned around yesterday, uh -huh. you could see it all, bro. Oh, but you know what? It's because the way it is, too, bro. It's how it's made. You know what I'm saying? No, this thing is buckled. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Look at how it's made. It's this piece put to that piece, but it's all that. Yeah, this is grossly, grossly overweight. Huh? Grossly overweight. Hopefully, yeah, we'll get the weight out of the top out. Hopefully, it just comes up. Go ahead. Don't worry. It doesn't crack up. Really locked up. I think all of you are the same right there, no? Yeah. Samsung, bro. Samsung lithium batteries. What did it say? Does it have a weight? It doesn't have a weight. Oh, it does say right there. Weight 32 tons. 32 tons. Lithium battery. Crazy, 64,000. 64? Yeah. You know, I think it shaved off at the bottom. I know. If it's actually mine, I'll be shocked because there's like more than 20 of them. Yeah, there's a lot of them. Yeah. Yeah, they're all over this place. Yeah. Down the freeway too, you can see them. See, look at there's some right there. Oh. I grabbed some because they were all here, so I grabbed them, I put them there. Yeah, Remember, this is the big word, bro. All oh, right. Detrimental. Detrimental. How are you doing, sir? Yeah. Just asking about how many lanes you guys need and how long. We need two lanes, so two lanes? number three and uh, and four. Okay. And it's probably gonna be. Uh, last time I told the guys about uh, about an hour. Okay. And change. Just gotta lift it off. We have already our trailer and route to off to take this. And then this one's gonna pull forward. Gotcha. Okay, so right, let's give us a little bit. Uh, we're gonna run back to office real quick, grab some more cones and whatnot. We'll be back and get you guys set up. Um, one more thing, I, I'm gonna need a break to turn one of the trucks around. Oh, okay. Because it's a 20 footer. Gotcha. So if I go back to back, the boom is too far for the to, to reach, especially since it's heavy. It's 64,000 pounds. Okay. So it's a heavy load. Uh, when will you need that break? Uh, as soon as you guys are set up with your two lanes, then I could just turn around and then set back up. You ready? Yeah. All right, gotcha. Thank you, man. Worries. Appreciate it. Orange day. Orange day. Very quick. Get up. Black key. I know. I'm gonna get a fight, bro. So as you can see, CHP is running the brake for us, so I could turn around Big Flipper.
I'm just gonna hug it real close. I was gonna wait till you uh, set up, and then from there on, I'll, I'll go ahead and uh, space my truck. That's what I'm saying. We're gonna hug the lane, or we're gonna get in between it, like in the middle. How you are right now, Brandon? Yeah, pretty much in the middle.
Yeah, go ahead. And drive it forward. Yeah. Can I go through there? Yeah, go ahead. Huh? There's a big gap? Okay. No matter what? You have the beams because you'll throw the beams underneath it when you put it on there. Drive off with it. <laughs> Grab, those beams. Grab the beams, Dave. What? He's probably gonna use the beams, no? What? He's gonna use the beams, no? The, beams? the beams. Big weight. Those lithium batteries are no joke. So now we're gonna have Martin from MST. Very good, very good friend of ours. Uh, he's gonna back under the this lithium battery, and uh, so we could set it on there on his uh, trailer to haul it away to, to Rancho Cucamonga. Is that what happened? Who TC'd? Yeah. Uh, that tanker with that car that was back there. Oh yeah? That's why she's there? Of course that was gonna happen, but where are you going? <clears throat> so now we have uh, Martin right here. With the trailer.
है Very nice, very close, but look at it. Just so you can see how close the tolerance is. So that way we don't take more, more lanes. Right there. Put that up on hands with. Very good. You got it? Must start doing that. that, that. <laughs> Bop, bop. This one gets over here. He's not gonna have to stretch? No, huh? Nah, no, it'll be fine. I think it'll be fine, right? Yeah, we got room. A little bit more. A little bit more. Right there. Okay, right there. <coughs> yeah. Go ahead. Looks good. We'll get it close and then we'll adjust the wood. Ready? Can lower yours? Wanna swing it this way? Right there? Oh, you there? I'm right on it. I'm right on it. Okay, you just gotta go in a little bit. Right? Go in? You got like seven inches off. Make it go that way. <coughs> You gotta play with all cable on yours. You wanna bring it this way a little bit? Swing again? Yeah. Okay, that's it. It's uh I'm assuming it's eight, so this is eight, uh eight six, so we got three inches on each side. So if you got like three right here, we're good. Okay, we're good. What? Yeah? Right there? I'll adjust mine after. It's gotta go this way, no? You go a little bit that way. On his end or my end? Uh, we gotta go both. both. Okay. Remember, it's three inches. I mean, that's six. Right here is six. It's just three right here. Right red? The six inch rail.
like right there. See that? Right there. Okay, let me fix the wood then. It's not even on the wood. Go up. Right there. There you go. Hold it. Hold it right there. Yes, sir. Am I gonna be on Instagram? What happened? Am I gonna be on Instagram? No, I don't think it'll be. Uh, no, just for us. Where does that go? The footage we posted on YouTube. Yeah? What's the page? Peeps? Pepe's Towing Service. It's, it's gonna be on YouTube? Yeah, everything will be on YouTube. Alright, I'm yeah. a YouTuber too. Oh, nice. I got 700,000 subscribers. Oh, no way. I'll shout you. We have 130,000. What's up, man? <laughs> yeah, we've already started, man. But well, we get a lot of views, so that's good. What's up, man? That's What's up. your page? I sing, I'm, I'm in Turkey though, Turkish. Oh. I'm, in Turkey I'm big, but in America truck. Oh, nice. Basically. That's all that matters, man. Yeah, it's, all good. it's good though. But you guys are amazing, man. Thank you so much. Thank man. you. What's gonna happen? I mean, you guys spoke to my dispatcher, right? I guess. We're yeah, we're taking it to Rancho, yeah, and yeah, I'll Rancho, float it over there. I'll float it to the other truck, right? My uncle's truck. Uh, yes. Uh, I'll float it. That's fine, yeah, wherever yeah. we want. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. No worries. That's no problem. This? Very tall. Good. 
Ready to turn the truck around while the yes. traffic's still heavy? Yes, sir. I'll stop on them and just turn around. Okay, thank you. So now uh, Martin pretty much has it all chained up. Oh, he still needs one more. So finish uh, chaining up the, the container and we'll start heading over to uh, Rancho Cucamonga. I think Specialized Transport, MST. Do you ever guys need uh, any type of uh, heavy haul? Martin's your guy. You need chains? Yeah, you know what? Do you have any of those? So I can grab here, so I can grab it back here? Do I have some of what, of those? Yeah, something to grab it so I can put my foot and grab it right here. Uh, well, those only fit on the on this portion. This portion's too thick. Well, uh, you have that it's there. Uh, I mean, I could I could use another chain. Oh, so then. Okay, yeah, I could grab another small little container chain or something. This is an endless, I can use the endless. The endless part? Yeah. Put the, yeah, put the endless through here and then ratchet the other. Yeah, that's, I'll, I got two things There you go, I just grab one mic. Do you have another one? Wow, wow. So how many, how many more chains do you need, Martin? Martin, how many more chains do you need? So I, I'm gonna get the bottom, but I need some. I gotta get the top and the bottom. Okay. Okay. Are they be fine with these? No. No, he's gonna give it back to us. Fifteen footer, got it. The long ones? The any, uh, I have four 15 footers and three binders. What else do you need? 
Yeah, what one do you have? Four 15 footers. Okay. Uh, that'll be fine. Let me let me secure this. We'll put something up this. You don't have any small ones? Small ones? I just have long ones, 15 footers. Three eighths? I have three eighths chain. Yeah, three eighths. Wow, uh, what length? Uh, to go down to here. We'll go again from there to there, there to there. Okay. Let me, let me. Give that one to David. That, that one right there. And we'll, we'll see. David. Whatever. Do you need help? Do you want to go get up there? No, he's already up there. Yeah, go get it. The trailer too, or what's what's he gonna do with the truck and trailer? He's gonna haul it off. Okay. The aluminum says uh, with all the weight it bowed, but right now it sprung back up like 10 inches. You guys gotta drive uh, straight to the address that my dispatcher gave, right? Yeah. To so upload and go to the other trailer right yes. away. Okay, then uh, I'm gonna follow you guys then. That's fine. Yeah. I mean, you guys side too, it's fine to drive it. Right? Yeah, it, it looks like it sprung up, so yeah. there's no more weight on it. So it should yeah. be fine. I'm just. I'd go down. slow, but. Yeah, I'll just follow. You guys gotta go slow anyway. Yeah. Alright, I'll just follow. Ready to roll. He's all chained up. Has his chains there. Chains at the bottom. He's got his, uh, his straps. Chain set up here. All right to go. CHP is going to start clearing lane, so thanks, guys. Dave's going to take off. That's it. All right, guys, on the next one. Thank you. Peace. So now we're in uh, Rancho Cucamonga here to uh, offload and uh, place it on a different trailer to transport. Dave is setting up his truck. I pretty much have my truck uh, almost ready to go. Ready? Thank you, man. Much appreciate it. Of course.